This is the island help. Uh, you can see you can create an island, join your island, teleport to your home, teleport to other islands, other commands, and skyblock info. Hey there guys, MCB here, and today we are going to be doing a Minecraft Pocket Edition server review. Now, we are here on the Imperials Network. Currently, it is only for Skyblock, but uh, it is changing. Uh, as you guys can see, this does say Prison coming soon, and there is a faction server, or at least there has been a faction server in the past, which was the main thing on here. Um... But just yesterday, there were, like, 11 players on, so obviously it's not a very inactive server. Um, like, I, I haven't ever checked how many people this has at, like, peak times or anything. But, I mean, last night, late at night, it had, like, 13, and right now, pretty early in the morning, it's got um, 8. Like, you can see the people that are playing this 6.48 p.m. for them, so late for him, and... For this guy, it's 4 a.m., so it looks like a lot of people here have, like, complete opposite time zones. But, um, yeah. Anyways, guys, this is a Skyblock server. Now, for a Skyblock server, this is very well made. A lot of Skyblock servers, I can see they have, like, really poor spawns, uh, really poor shops. Um, like, as in poorly made, not in terms of actual money. Um, and their commands aren't really too in-depth, but... If you guys do slash is, you can see that there are quite a few stuff, and they're all put into like a little menu GUI, which is very, very good. It's very useful. And you can see, joined first time, use kit once. I'm not going to use that just yet, but once I get to my island and set all that up, I will. So yeah, this is the island help. Uh, you can see you can create an island, join your island, teleport to your home. That is buggy. I'm not exactly sure why, but they did say that sometimes you'd crash. Um, teleport to other islands, other commands, and Skyblock Info. So I'm assuming Skyblock Info... Yeah, look at all this. Tons and tons of different commands. So yeah, let's go ahead and create our island. There we... Don't go. What the heck? Okay. Well... Hmm. Weird. Okay, well, now that I've created my island, can I join it? There we go. So this is my island, and currently right here, I'm assuming this is uh, kind of a tutorial. No lava or water is required to create a generator. Place an end stone and mineral blocks will appear above it. Enchant and or do not use hacks. Slash is help. Uh, unknown error. Okay, so yeah, that's that's why that happened. And buy ranks at their store, ESPE.bycraft.net. Also, you can vote for them and join their Discord community. Nice. So I need to go ahead and do my kits. So uh, let's do slash kits. Now, typically, from what I've seen, uh, Skyblock servers don't often have kits. So this is definitely a uh, un this is definitely unique in that in that way. So I'm going to do kit starter, kit monthly, can I not do slash kit slash kits slash kits starter? That is not how it usually is, but okay. And slash kits monthly. There we go. So let's go ahead and place down our monthly kit. Got everything in our inventory. And place down our starter kit. Okay. And then we will get kits once and place that down. There we go. So this now is all that we've got. We need to place down this end stone. So let me, um, where do I want my end stone to be? I think I want to put it right here. And my inventory is a little bit full, so I'm going to place that down. There we go. And the other block I just picked up, we will place right back here. Now we do have... No, we don't. Not yet, at least. Okay, here, let me um, mine through this wood here. And I need to create myself a bunch of stuff to craft, basically. Um, let me throw out something I don't need. Say, I pretty much need anything, everything in here. Um, crap. Okay, 
So, can I do slash PV? Is that a thing? Slash PV? No, how about... No, I can't do that. Okay. Then I will just throw out this steak then. So that I'll have enough room to craft stuff. Okay. So, crafting table. Okay. Uh, place this down right here. Pick this back up. And we will... Create our chests. This is really weird. I don't know why this is crafting like this. It shouldn't be. Yeah, I don't know what it is with this lag. It's so weird. It's not planned at all, but whatever. Okay, so let's take these extra bits out if I can, which I probably can't because. I'm getting like three frames a second. Um, there we go. So let's place these chests right here. N what? No, place right here. Why'd you do that? What? 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 Visual glitch much? Why do I have three chests now? What is this? I'm so confused. Okay, well, it appears I have accidentally duped a chest, or maybe there was already a chest here and I didn't see it. Please don't ban me from the server. Please. I, I, I beg. Okay, let's, let's kind of organize this a bit. Well, we don't really need to. I mean, this is just a review. It's not a series, though I might actually do a series here. In the future because this server does look awesome to be completely honest it looks pretty awesome so i'm gonna go just put all the stuff in here now this is a skyblock server just like any other you have nothing too special in terms of the way that skyblock works other than the um other than the fact that it is like really in depth with all of its commands and that you can just like look at this guys that's got to be the fastest thing ever like and this is straight off the bat i haven't been playing for like any time at all you can just immediately start doing this it's pretty pretty cool pretty cool but, uh, yeah, that's, it's very, very easy to grind, and I'm not sure if it's allowed, um, but AFK mining seems to be very possible, because there are some servers where it's just not, not even worth it, because of how slow you mine, but this, like, right off the bat, you're getting so much per minute, that's definitely worth it. But anyways, let's do dot slash spawn now, and let us... Let me show you the other stuff. So there are other ESPE warps. There's the shop, PvP, custom enchants, and crates. Now, oh, okay, well, this is crates. Um, crates, I'm assuming there's vote crates, but there's also ones you can buy from the shop. Um, like the online shop. You can't abuse your keys. I don't know how you'd be able to do that, but sure. Um, so these are all the different crates. There's... It looks like there's only three up right now. So I would assume this one's probably Vote Crate. And then these other two you'd buy. Although I'm not exactly sure. Because it doesn't let me in. Okay, so that one's Hero. Uh, this one is Imperials, which is probably the like, best key you can get. And Vote Key. Yep, about what I thought. And apparently over here it just says to jump down and chill in nature. So you know, why not? I mean... You know, that's pretty cool. Actually, this looks like really cool. Good job on this map, whoever made it. It looks really cool. Alright, uh... So now, let's go back to slash spawn. And I will show you all the, uh... Shop. Let me show you guys the shop on ESP. So let's go to the shop. And as you guys can see, this is a pretty old-fashioned shop. I do remember a lot... Like a lot of old elite servers looking like this and then there was also the cryptic shop cryptic uh faction shop which looked very similar so we've got uh wool and glass dyes over here we got blocks uh, miscellaneous and i have no clue what is down this way 
It looks like... What? Why did you just say island and they will work? Also, why is there an enderman here? Go away. Why are you, why are you here? I don't know what this is doing here, so I'm just going to kill it and give myself an ender pearl, you know? Uh, but this seems to be spawners. Oh, well, okay. You ruined my fun, man. If you call murdering Enderman fun, but I don't. Okay, uh, slash spawn. So yeah, the shop is very, it has basically everything you need. And it's pretty simple, kind of nostalgic, reminiscent of older servers, to say the least. Uh, and then we've also got the custom enchant shop, which has the same design. Um, but, you know, custom enchants. And so I would assume that this has, you know, armor and... So yeah, like, look at this. So this is... I think this says helmet. Yeah, helmet CE. Chest play CE. Uh, probably leggings CE. And boots CE. I don't know why leggings CE doesn't have a sign, but it doesn't. Weird. But yeah, that's leggings um, custom enchants. And then over here is probably tools, maybe. Maybe swords. Pickaxe, so yeah, this tools. Pickaxe, uh, as an axe. No, it says bow, bow, uh, sword. Looks like some of their CEs are missing for whatever reason. I'm not exactly sure why. Oh, there's a sign here. I don't know why it wasn't showing up for me, but there's definitely a sign there. And here. Okay, so for whatever reason, some of the stuff is not loading up. Okay, I, I, I do not get why this is happening, but it is. Okay, uh, and... Hosey. I don't know why there's so many for the hoe, and then there's, like, two for the sword, but okay then. So, if that's armor and tools, then what's in these other ones? Are these ones empty? Yeah, they are. Okay, well... That's a little anticlimactic. I thought there was going to be, like, some sort of added tool or, like, custom enchants for some, like, apples, because I've seen those before. And they are pretty overpowered. But now that we've gone through that, let's go to probably the most important warp, the PvP warp. I... it's still loading. Here we go. So it's got a bunch of dyed green glass and these little red things, and you drop down, and it basically looks like... A world with an infection. Uh, this is... I'm not sure I'm the biggest fan of this. I don't get how sand is green. I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to be happening, but... It's happening. So... Yeah. It's just, just a kind of flat, greenish... PvP arena, and it looked like there was stuff over here, but no, kind of empty. It's got some torches just sort of strewn around... So that, this is probably not the best PvP arena. If I would have to say that there's one warp which is not the best, it's definitely this PvP arena. Just, just saying. Just saying. But, um, yeah, guys, that's basically gonna be it for the video. I... If I have any criticism for the owners, it would basically just be to cut off the unused rooms in the custom enchant area and to, um change or even remove would be better that thing is just an eyesore that pvp arena um it's just just it's just so bad but um yeah guys i would probably rate this server like an eight or a nine out of ten to be honest it's a very very good server possibly the best skyblock server i have ever seen i'm kind of trying to decide between this and hybrid because i think hybrid by itself would be much better by far but it's also um kind of well, let's just say the way that I got banned was a little a little abusive of the staff, the way I got banned. And so I've got some kind of bad experiences in terms of that. But uh, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did. And peace.